Buongiorno. Good morning. Day 36 on the Via Francigena, and we are in the heart of Tuscany. We have an exciting couple of days ahead of us. I'm really excited. So today we're leaving Gambasi Terme. We actually haven't gotten to it yet because this hostel, uh, the Ostello Sigirico, is about a kilometer below the town. So we have to start our morning. We got there the yesterday. <laughs> up to the top of the stage. Ooh. And then we are heading from here to San Giamagno. We did walk to, to Gambasi yesterday uh, along with everybody else because we all needed lunch. <laughs> um, the views today um, are pure Tuscany. This is kind of, <laughs> today is the day we came yes. on this trip yes. just about. And then tomorrow uh, we're in another little village that are just, the, these two towns are just kind of the whole embodiment of everything that Tuscany uh, is on the calendar. <laughs> we have two weeks to Rome, or 339 kilometers. Oof, so. that sounds like a lot still. Well, enjoy the views, um, take screenshots, and make your own calendar. <laughs> Andiamo. Over there, that was our view last night out our window, and this in front of us is our view for today. Tonight we'll be on top of the hill again. What amazing Tuscan views. Let's go. The views are so beautiful, I didn't even notice that we're climbing down this hill so that we can climb up that one. Is that a joke? Because the gong show's over. Nope. No, no it, it's not a joke. We're climbing up that hill. I know, but look how beautiful it is. I, every Stunning. place you look looks like it could be the cover of a calendar that yes. says Tuscany. Yes. When people think of Tuscany, they think of this. So ignore everything you saw in all of our other videos. That wasn't really Tuscany. <laughs> Seriously, a wine tasting, and they're not open at 9.30 in the morning. What is wrong with these people? <laughs> you know those rosemary plants you buy at the grocery store and hope to grow it so you have fresh rosemary? This is what happens if you treat them well. This oh. hedge of rosemary. Once again, wish it was smell-o-vision. Come on, YouTube, get on that. Um, hey, Brian. The Via Francigena is up there. Um, it cuts through next to this winery. But it's only 9.45 in the morning. And? And a glass of white wine sounds lovely. I mean, it is I mean, Tuscany. It I've is walked Tuscany. a lot this morning already. I think I deserve it. I you think, can watch if you don't want one. I think I got them. I talked out of one yesterday, but I don't think it's going to happen today. I don't think it's going to happen. I think it is going to happen today. <laughs> today it's going to happen. Vino. Michelle. I convinced Michelle to walk in the door. He did. He didn't have to work very hard. It's Tuscany. <laughs> because it's only 9.45, they weren't technically open yet. But she said since we walked by, we needed to try the wine. So. It is absolutely, I mean, I think we're both quite giddy because it's Tuscany. And it's our first wine tasting of the entire trip. We've obviously had wine and drinks as you've seen, but this is our first just sit down and do a tasting, you know, with a menu and tasting notes. And and it, here at Sasani, they have eight wines and you get to do a full tasting 
for six euros per person. So quite a deal. Absolutely. And then there's an olive oil too. So, and we do have to, while sitting here, suffer through this <laughs> view of the vineyards. We are here at Cesani Winery and Agriturismo. It's got a B&B. &B. There's a restaurant. We are, we found heaven. I it's really, amazing. I really think we have. We got here at 9.45. It's 10.30 now. We're almost finished with our wine tasting. Um, many people would say, whoa, you're spending so much time here. How are you going to walk? It's fine. We're in Tuscany. And honestly, we're not in a hurry. Class. We're not in a hurry. And you know, walking 450 kilometers to <laughs> get here has made this wine so good. So much better. People yeah. have asked us all along, why are you doing this? Why are you walking this yeah. pilgrimage? Um, this is one of the reasons. Yeah, I think to enjoy this, this view, these moments, these moments, because not every day is sunshine and wine. <laughs> but we've been sitting here enjoying each other's company, enjoying the wine, getting an amazing lesson of the wines and the grapes of the region. Yeah. Um, this has just been a phenomenal stop worth every, every... moment that we've wasted well, sitting here. Or Dolce, Dolce Farniette. Yes. Um, we have seven kilometers to go. They're going to be a little bit more challenging, but it, it's like we're going to be doing it with a smile on our face because we have the views around us and we've had this moment. Yeah. yeah. This... These are the reasons. You can't pass them up because of time or because of what's ahead of you. You have to just embrace what comes before you. Stop and smell the roses, yes. Stop and smell the wine, absolutely. That's what the region's all about in many respects. Salute. Cheers. Amazing. Amazing. Sandy says go down to see the life size. So we don't stop at every winery we walk past. you have been following all along our journey, you will be surprised to hear that right now we did not take a road shortcut. What? We are opting to climb this hill and then climb back down it to the road <laughs> because today it has been all about the views. All about the views today. And we are enjoying it and we've got about 5k to go. It is a little afternoon. Which normally we'd be done by now but the weather goddess is being gracious to us so far well and then there was the uh goddess of vino who is that well bacchus <laughs> is the god of wine uh, bacchus was good to us and gave us a two-hour pit stop at that winery which was worth every, every minute yes and now we're gonna climb and we'll show you more of the view and the uh, vineyards of the winery we were just at One more step closer to San Germano.
3.2 yeah. kilometers. 3.2 kilometers away right now. We have to go down 60 meters and then back up 70 meters or the other way around? We have to go down 61 and up 75. There you go. It's worth every bit of it. It's so beautiful today. Or San Jimmy, <laughs> as those in the know hipsters call it. Oh, is that what we are? Shh, don't tell anyone, they'll laugh. Well, it's For a month, I'd say we find we've had plenty of outstanding gelato, but this apparently is the place that all the tourists want to go. I would recommend that they find a little mom and pop, but I'm not gonna tell them. There are at least six other places selling gelato within 50 meters of here. At least. Buongiorno. Good morning. It is day 36, Michelle tells me, on the Via Francigena. <laughs> and today we are walking from San Giamanio to Monteregioni. Which is 31 kilometers. However, there's a festival. There's a festival, and we want to get to the festival. So our pilgrimage looks a little different today. So we want to be fresh because it's going to be a late day and yeah, late. possibly a night with not a lot of sleep. So we wanted to be fresh. So we did take a, uh, a taxi, so to speak. So to speak our, our host, host yeah. offered to, to drive us ahead. So we are in Garat Garciano. I think it's Gar Garciano. Uh oh, sorry, Italy. And uh, there's some hot springs right here behind us, which are Swimming beautiful. Hole of some sort. It looks very comfortable. It does. The water is beautiful. And I could be thoroughly distracted and just go get in there, but Brian but tells me when I have to get to the festival. We have 11 kilometers ahead to get to Montregioni and the festival. We are going to see fireworks, I hope, tonight, if we are able to, to stay, stay up. up. They start at 1030, this late. and then the closing concert of the festival is at 11 p.m. on a Sunday. We've heard fireworks twice and couldn't get out of bed to go see them. So maybe, maybe not. Regardless, this is a Renaissance festival to celebrate. So we'll tell you all about it as we're showing the festival, but we need to get walking. First, let's show a walk. Here we go. A new home for a while, let me feel alive. Nothing to hold me back, take my time, just enjoy the ride. A new man passing by, life is good, best I've ever felt. Get me up, so in, so where I can find myself. I feel, I feel, I feel, I feel so alive As you feel, I feel, I feel, I feel, I feel so alive 
As I reach out, reach out, reach out, reach out to the sky I found my way, I found my way I was in the dark, against it all, but made it through the day Cause I found my way, I found my way In bad times, I know I'll be okay Cause I found my way We have a quarter mile to walk but that's where we're going. Cause I found my way. Hold on, I don't want him to hear me breathing. <laughs> or cursing. a renderci felici verranno sulla piazza de Scannagallo le danzatrici le danzatrici che con le loro leggiadre, gagliarde e carole vi faranno fare a meno delle mie parole
Oh, 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 oh,